guys, it's me, Epic Gamer Josh, and today I'm talking about my first two months as a YouTuber. Now, this is also a question and answer video as well. So, if you guys have any questions, feel free to pop in, pop them in the comments, and I will answer them in either a separate video or on a stream later today. Later on today, I will be streaming Fortnite. So make sure you tune into that. And then tomorrow I will be streaming my first ever episode of Monday Night Raw. Now if you've uh, watched my uh, Friday Night Smackdown episode and you thought it was brilliant, you won't want to miss Monday Night Raw's episode. So anyways, I'm going to tell you now about my experience being a YouTuber for the last two months and what I've enjoyed about it, what I've not enjoyed about it and you know take you a bit behind the scenes on me behind the TV, me behind the games so yeah um, <clears throat> so is being a YouTuber fun? <laughs> damn right it is yeah I mean it's really really fun um, every day I'm putting the hard work to bring you the streams that you love from games such as GTA and WWE and FIFA. Obviously, every video I do, I have to plan carefully to try not like to repeat myself the same thing. So, like for, ex for example, on a Wednesday, I might stream FIFA um, career mode, then do the same again the next day and do exactly the same. I don't want to become a bit repetitive, so what I do is I try rename my videos as differently as I can. And so far it has worked. But I want to tell you something now about me and um, what I thought before I started YouTube. Before I started YouTube, I thought, oh, people are in it just for the money, blah, blah, blah. You know, people are in it to. You know, just for the money, just for the fame, you know, like celebrities and movie stars and footballers and most football players and whatnot. But I'm not in it for the money, I'm in it for the pure joy of sharing the games that I love to play with you guys. And over the last two months I've gained, you know, I've smashed a few targets already and I've gained 71 subscribers from you know, countries that I never thought I'd get subscribers from, such as uh, Pakistan, USA, Canada, Ireland, United Kingdom, Spain, Portugal. But, yeah. My first two months as a YouTuber has been really, really amazing. And if you want to become a YouTuber and stream games, then I would highly recommend you do that because um, not only will you have fun in doing it you will get to meet people who you never would have imagined meeting you you would be able to talk to people from other countries that you'd never be able to talk to normally and obviously in these tough times supporting each other and you know talking to each other is a key to getting through this tough time but yeah, um, YouTube is fantastic and if you're in it just for the pure entertainment like I am, then you have to know something as well. You have to know that even though you're being entertained, it takes a lot of hard work to put you know, a stream onto YouTube. You have to know what you're doing and you know engage with your audience two months ago when i started youtube i had no idea what i was doing all, all i've got i don't have no fancy equipment all i've got is my playstation my headset and my controller and my tv obviously that's it i don't have any fancy equipment no gaming wheels no playstation cameras no you know none of that fancy crap I just do it, you know, with the basics. And over the last two months, I've gained, well, four, 71 subscribers. I mean, it's amazing. 
when I when I first started YouTube, I was a bit scared because I thought, oh, what about if nobody likes me? What about if you know I'm putting the hard work and the effort into my streams and nobody's watching and nobody's you know popping in and saying, hey, Epidemic Josh, how are you? Or uh, you know, I felt scared that nobody would like look at my videos and think, oh, okay. I like I like this guy's video. I'm I'm gonna like him. I'm gonna comment on him. And I'm gonna subscribe to see what he does. But I never would have thought that I would get 71 subscribers in the space of like two months. It's been it's been quite a roller coaster to be honest. Uh, my first my first ever video. I mean that got 50 views. And looking back. I don't regret starting YouTube. I don't, I really don't regret becoming a YouTuber because being a YouTuber is just so fun. But it's not just fun, it's also energy consuming as well because when you do YouTube, you have to think about what you're doing, think about what game you're gonna stream. If you're like me, a gaming YouTuber. You need to think about, hmm, what should I do on this game? What should I do on that game? Oh, what should the description of the video be? Oh, what should I call the video? And that takes, you know, a mental time to come up with. That's why every Tuesday I take a day off from streaming. So I can have a look through my channel, have a look at the videos that has the most views or the most likes and, you know, streamline them down so that I'm bringing you streams of those games with m most views but yeah um, obviously throughout your YouTube career you are going to have a few people who are a bit salty and you know um, dislike your videos I mean over the last month or so I've had at least one person disliking my videos but what annoys me the most when someone dislikes a video is that they dislike it but they don't have the nerve to come to drop a comment and say hey epic gamer josh my name is blah 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 i dislike your video because blah 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 yeah that really annoys me because you know someone disliking your videos it kind of knocks something that kind of knocks you down a bit because you're like oh I'm doing something wrong what am I doing wrong and how can I fix it so that's why I always say in every video that, that I do if you do dislike one of my videos then don't be a coward you know grow some balls get your balls out of your mum's purse and you know come and say that you dislike my video and tell me why because if I'm doing something wrong and you're not telling me then how am I supposed to know I'm doing something wrong if I'm playing a game that you don't want me to play or if I'm playing a game and I'm crap at it yeah so what everyone's gonna be crap at one or two games like me I'm gonna be really honest now I'm absolutely shit at Fortnite. I really am. I I'm really crap at it. But yeah, I'm so good at it. But what I mean by so good at Fortnite is like I'm getting the kills, I'm getting the victories, but I'm so crap because I don't know how to build. <laughs> um obviously as you've seen from a Rocket League stream, I am absolutely a pile of garbage at Rocket League. I know it's uh, football for cars, but I mean, I just not really into the game as much. But I'll always, you know, stream it for you guys. I, I'm not really into Fortnite, but I stream it for you guys because at the end of the day, I can only grow as a YouTuber if I'm doing things for you. You want a Fortnite video? Yeah, I'll do a Fortnite video. You want a GTA video? Of course I will. The only, the only things that will make me a bit 
Like, uh, mm, confused is if you ask me to stream a game that I don't physically have. <laughs> That's why the games I stream, they may seem repetitive, but it's the games that I have. And obviously, because I've got my own place with my fiance, I can't just buy games all the time. I need to, you know, pay bills as well. And yeah, even though I have money left after bills, you know, every money that I have left goes to save up for, you know, holidays or, well, as Americans call it, vacations. Well, as we call it here in the UK, holidays. Uh, we can afford to do things that we love to do, like get a season ticket for my, my team, Bradford City. <laughs> Go get a season ticket for them again. I used to be a season ticket holder at Bradford City, but, you know, stop going because I couldn't afford it anymore. But, anyways, if you want to become a YouTuber, then and stream games then by all means do don't be afraid to do it like I was I I was afraid to do it at one point but then I thought you know what fuck it do it and if you know you don't get any views you don't get any views and now since the first day of stream compared to now I feel like I've become better as a YouTuber because not only am I bringing you longer streams I'm also you know playing more games and you know doing the thing doing random things like my most popular videos are my Chelsea career videos Chelsea career mode videos on FIFA and GTA epicness and randomness and believe me on I do get random on GTA but I would definitely recommend becoming a YouTuber. I mean, there are you loads of gaming YouTubers out there that stream the most popular games, but my advice is if you are to become a gaming YouTuber, don't go straight into the popular games because highly likely you won't get as many views or subscribers because they might think, well, What's going to subscribe to you? I can go watch, uh, for example, The Game in Lemon on GTA. Why do I need to watch you? And obviously, over the last couple of months, I've had to change the way I introduce my videos, the way I, you know, engage with my subscribers. And, you know, engaging with subscribers and changing my intros to videos and you know being myself on the videos that I do that has got me 71 subscribers now before I end this video and allow you to ask whatever questions you want to ask about my first two months as YouTuber my advice to YouTubers to people that are wanting to become a gaming YouTuber is go for it. I mean, it is a lot, bunch of load of fun. When, like I said before, I before I became a YouTuber, I thought mm, no one's gonna watch me, no one's gonna like my videos, no one's gonna you know subscribe to me. So two months later, and 71 subscribers later, and 1,600 views across all my videos later. You know, I've, um, I now take that back and I don't look back and think it was a mistake because it wasn't. Me being a YouTuber has actually brought the life back into me. I mean, um, I am going to get a bit personal now, but over the last few years I've had, I've had a rocky road experience, I've had a roller coaster experience. I mean, I've been um, torn apart left, right and centre. Um, I've had uh, two fat, fat bitches, well, two fat sluts cheat on me for, you know, bizarre reasons. 
Um, I've, you know, I've been hated because of rumours going around about me that, you know, I don't know. But yeah, the last two months has definitely brought out um, some of the best that I've seen. And my advice is, if you want to become a YouTuber, then definitely go ahead and do it. I mean, I highly recommend it because you're going to have a bunch load of fun and plus as well if any of you do become a YouTuber then obviously come subscribe to me say hey Josh I watch your video and now a YouTuber stream games I will obviously come and subscribe to you as well and help you as much as I can now in terms of uh, streaming games when you first become a YouTuber um, I don't know whether you want to take this advice or not, but I took my own advice and it's worked out fine for me. Don't start off by streaming the most popular games, because there's loads of better YouTubers out there, loads of big time, big time YouTubers with millions of subscribers and millions of views that, you know, play that play the most popular games. I would go back, I would go down the back lanes and stream games that aren't so popular. Like, the games that are popular right now are COD, uh, GTA, FIFA, um, Rocket League, Fortnite, you know, those games that I've said, they're popular. And if you start off with a popular game, they won't, you won't get any, well, you might get subscribers if you're lucky enough, but you'll have a hard time getting subscribers. Do what I did. I, I went down the back lanes and I thought, ooh, train some world. You know, um, cater for people who love simulation games because there's not many simulation games out there that are popular. Because most simulation games are on PC and you know there's not many there's not much of a market for it. I did Train Sim World 2. It's not the best game out there, don't get me wrong. But I have pure joy in playing it and you know since then I've edged round and dug myself into the popular game system. And yeah I mean I am where I am now because of the way I've chosen to be a YouTuber. I, instead of diving in for it and going for GTA or everything, I started with the less popular games. And, you know, I am where I am now. And it's all thanks to you guys for subscribing to me and for watching my videos. I mean, if it wasn't for you guys, I wouldn't be here doing this video now. And with it being a day off work, I probably would have been either going out walking, you know, listening to music, or watching TV, or even, you know, playing on the PS. But because of you guys, I'm I'm streaming every day, you know, I'm and I'm showing you what, you know, what Epic Gamer Josh is like. <laughs> because prior to me starting YouTube, I, I used to get random anyway on games with friends. And they've always suggested to me, oh, why don't you become a YouTuber? And they did. And since then, I've not looked back. I'm not, I don't regret it at all. I mean, I'm, I'm really looking forward to the next two months and the next two years or the next ten years because as time goes by I'm going to be better as a YouTuber but anyways enough talk about me being a YouTuber for the first two months um, let's uh, I'm not going to end the video yet but I'm just going to you know um, shout out a few people who are worthy of a shout out 
First of all, my my boy Ryan Cooper and Score YT Gaming. Go check out his channel. Go check out his videos. He does fantastic streams on the games that he does videos on, and he does joint streams with me most times on GTA or Bus Simulator. And he does COD as well. So if you're a fan of COD, fan of GTA, and fan of Bus Simulator, go check out his videos as well and. Go show him the same love and support as you show me and go and subscribe to him. Another shout out is to <clears throat> is to someone that's uh, recently come onto my streams from Australia. Well, he says he's from Australia, but <laughs> nobody knows these days. Um, but his name's called Elite Gaming and he has done well in supporting me. Even though he doesn't, even though he says he doesn't need shouting out, I think he deserves a shout out because he has helped me these last this last week or so. He even deep down, he even um, not knowingly allowed me to, you know, just bring out the best of me on GTA. So yeah, go subscribe to him. Go check out his videos. And one more, a couple of more shout outs. I want to shout out to uh, Just Abdul. Um, congratulations on getting your goal of 100 subscribers, bro. Um, yeah, I mean, that is one heck of an achievement and it's taken you so long to do it. So please help him get to his next goal of 500, I think it's 200 subscribers, obviously 500. I'm just going to say 500, just for the laugh of it. But help him get to 500 subscribers by watching his videos and subscribing to his channel. He says his voice is cringy, but like me, I think my voice is cringy. I don't know why, but everybody hates their own voice. So, you know, don't be harsh on him. Show him some love and support and go subscribe to him. But anyways, um, let's talk about um, what's coming up in the next uh, coming weeks and months ahead. Like, um, <clears throat> my first two months of a YouTuber has been a blast. Um, I have been left annoyed by the fact that... I'm not annoyed by people disliking my videos because I know that people are going to dislike my videos. But what annoys me the most about people disliking my videos is... Uh, they don't have the nerve to come and tell me that they've disliked and they don't give me the reasons why they've disliked they just dislike and then fuck off and never come back again or something but you know I want to um, ask my subscribers and viewers one one question well not one question but one request if I do a stream and you unfortunately dislike it and you put thumbs down to a video then please come and tell me why. I'm not going to snap at you and say I'm not going to you know snap at you, scream at you, shout at you, you know. Yeah, I just had to uh, quick look on the phone. Obviously, my uh, fiance has gone up to her dad's for a bit. You know, left me in peace. <laughs> left me alone here with, um, you know, to bring this video for you guys. And I need to do washing up as well. I need to do washing up as well before she comes back. Or she'll kill me. She'll kill me. <laughs> but anyways, yeah. My first two months as a YouTuber has been a roller coaster ride. My most, uh, I've had up moments, should say, um, getting 700 subscribers and 1,600 views across all of my videos. Um, if you thought the first two months was good, then the next two months is, I'm going to try and make even better. Over the coming weeks and months, I do have lots of new content planned for you on the games that I love to stream 
and maybe um, there may be a week there may be a times in the summer when um, I won't be able to stream because I might be going on holiday summer but I will let you know in due course about any plans but for now over the next coming weeks and months I have amazing content for you guys um, later on today I will be streaming Fortnite now if you want to join me on Fortnite then and possibly be part of the stream then come add me as a friend on PlayStation my PSN or gamer tag as people call it is epic underscore gamer underscore Josh so that's capital E for epic capital G for gamer capital J for Josh and as well as tonight's stream on Fortnite I'm aiming to do a three hour stream because that's the average time I stream on Fortnite. Um, tomorrow I will be streaming my first ever episode, my first ever episode of Monday Night Raw. Um, Monday Night Raw will take place every week on a Monday night and Friday Night Smackdown will take place every week on a Friday, on a Friday night and once a month on a Sunday I will be streaming a pay-per-view as well. The, the upcoming pay-per-view in just a few weeks time is Backlash. So if you watch my, uh, pardon me, if you watch my Friday Night Smackdown video and you really enjoyed the matches there and you really liked it, then you won't want to miss out Monday Night Raw because I have an, an amazing card for you, including a fantastic triple threat match for the Universal Championship. Now I could spoil it and tell you who the three superstars are that will be fighting for the Universal Championship but I'm not gonna spoil it, I'm just gonna leave it for you you guys to tune in and watch. <laughs> um, that stream will take place at 7.30 on the dot tomorrow night. Obviously UK time, <laughs> obviously time zones might be different from based on where you're living, but yeah. So, first of all, before I go, I want to thank you all so much for supporting me and, you know, um, over the last two months. I have really appreciated it. And, it, oh, I forgot, I forgot as well before I uh, say all before I say all the you know outro and everything. Um, obviously, yeah. Tonight I'm streaming Fortnite. Mon tomorrow night I'm streaming Monday Night Raw. On Tuesday is my day off, so you know I go through my channel, have a look at what videos have the most views, and streamline my content to bring you the games with the most views. But. Um, coming weeks and months ahead is going to be fantastic as uh, hopefully I'll probably get more games new games maybe hopefully WWE 2K22 will come out soon maybe FIFA 22 will come out soon as well nah nice drink of coffee there but yeah all the action on my channel every day apart from Tuesday the next few weeks and months are just going to be epic just like me because I'm an epic gamer Josh <laughs> obviously anyways guys before before I go I just want to tell you all that not in a gay way or any romantic way this is uh, a general way um, but to all my subscribers out there, I love you all very much. Uh, thank you for subscribing to me, I really do appreciate it. And for those that watch my videos, I really appreciate you watching my videos as well. Like I said, this is a question and answer video. If you want to ask me questions about anything relating to my first two months as a YouTuber, then feel free to drop your question down in the comments and I will answer your questions either in another video 
are in tonight's stream of Fortnite. So yeah, I've been Epic Gamer Josh and it's been a fantastic privilege to bring you this video, talking about my first two months as a YouTuber. It has been an epic adventure so far with lots more epic adventures to come, lots more to explore and lots more to lots more content to bring you guys. So then, yeah, that's it for this video. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Like I said, if you have any questions for me, or even even if it's a little piece of advice on how to be a better YouTuber, then feel free to drop it in the comments and I will answer the questions as best as I possibly can. But yeah, I've been Epic Gamer Josh. It's been a privilege to bring you this video. First of all, I'd like to tell you all to stay safe and stay positive through these tough times. Obviously, better days are coming. Better days are coming. <laughs> yeah, better days are coming. But, yeah. I mean, stay safe, stay positive. Obviously, if you, if you enjoy my videos, then don't forget to drop a like. And if you do want to watch my content or you want to check out me more, then... I'm not going to say please come and subscribe, I'm just going to say for the hell of it, come and subscribe. I mean, I have amazing content week in, week out. I engage with my subscribers the best way I can and I will always, you know, support you if you support me. Obviously, if you respect me, I respect you as well. So, I hope you all are stay, staying safe and um, I hope that you are well. And I hope you all had a good night's sleep last night. I did even though I totally forgot that clock went forward. And I ended up going to bed at uh, half past two. My bad. But with me not working today, obviously, I'm home all day long. So, you know, obviously, yeah, I'm home. I'm at home. <laughs> um, obviously, opposite me, I've got my TV, PS4 and controller and headset. I don't have just fancy equipment that other YouTubers have because, you know, I'm not a famous YouTuber yet. Although, I've had uh, one person add me on Snapchat who has managed to find me from watching my YouTube. I don't know how, but it is what it is. So, anyway, guys, I hope you're staying safe. I hope you're staying positive. Stay safe, stay positive. Um, have a good day. And I will see you later on today in my stream of Fortnite. Make sure you check in and say hi. And if you have any questions for me relating to my career as a YouTuber so far. And if you want to give me some advice or if you want some advice yourself about being a YouTuber. Then drop it in the comments and I will answer in a separate video or over the live stream later on today so then until next time i've been epic gamer josh and it's been a privilege to bring you this video peace out